welcome back to my channel. Ooh, this is heavy. Oh, this is heavy. Oh, it's heavy. But it's little. I... Huh. I knew it was on there somewhere. I bought some groceries from Target. So, Target has groceries that, like Walmart, you can get some food delivered to your house, whether or not you live in a delivery area. So what I mean by that is, we have grocery pickup. In some major cities, they have grocery delivery service. Um, I feel like it's from a service, like Peapod or something. I'm just making that up, but um, kind of like we have Instacart, so somebody actually delivers the food for them. But this is shelf stable. I feel like I just got a hair in my eye. I'm so sorry. This is shelf stable food that you can buy on Target.com and get delivered to your house. And let me show you why and what I picked and why I picked it and all the things. So I was talking to my sister, my sister who is coming for my birthday is doing is on the keto program as you know and my other sister one of the other sisters coming for my birthday is what is that oh they wrapped something in this i'll show you what i'm what i'm poking at but my other sister um one sister can't have dairy and red meat one can only have dairy and red meat And one can only have this much food at a time, so it's gonna be great, can't wait. <laughs> but they're all healthy and beautiful, so it doesn't make a difference. But look at that, I just freaked out or whatever this was. I was like, what is that? But that's how they wrapped a glass jar, which I think is pretty cool. Um, but while I was looking up some different sweeteners, uh, good prices for other sweeteners, I found that Target had my Metamucil that I haven't been able to find in Walmart last two times we ordered groceries but um it's metamucil's premium blend this is the first metamucil that i tried the reason i wanted to try this is because the advertisement and the research that i read showed how it helps reduce your blood sugar it's made with stevia which is great artificial sweetness sometimes can spike your blood sugar but stevia is natural and it won't for most people um and it just helps lower your cholesterol and your blood sugar and it's really tasty and delicious and besides you know fiber um, but this was the really big can like normally we just get um, like a 15 ounce well we get a 72 serving one this one is a hundred and fourteen servings or 144 servings no because it wasn't twice as much so maybe it was 114 I don't know I'll I'll try to remember to put the numbers down there but we picked up this I ordered this and it was this was like $22 and change. And for $25, you get free shipping. So I just picked up some other sugar-free things that I thought would be interesting to try. One of them is Heinz's No Sugar Added Ketchup. Now this isn't sugar-free, this is no sugar added because tomatoes naturally have sugar in them. Um, but this bottle is like dented and stuff, but that's okay, as soon as I open it, it'll be fine. Um, this has, let me get my, let me get my glasses and read you the nutrition label. This has one total carb and it has less than one gram of sugar in it. And there's 10 calories per tablespoon, which is really good. So I'm gonna try that. Never tried it before. I was wondering, like yesterday we made um, Jim's dad's smothered pork chops and I wonder how, since you already add apple jelly to it, if we could reduce the sugar by using no sugar added um, Ketchup might be better, you know, might be better for me. This, I was really excited because, um, have you ever heard of Sweet Baby Ray's? Well, Sweet Baby Ray's, and I'm gonna just rip this plastic open because they have it wrapped like this in case, I guess in case it broke. Um, Sweet Baby Ray's has a no sugar added and it's just called Ray's. He's not sweet and he's not a baby, he's just Ray. Ray's new sugar added original barbecue sauce. When I went to the target.com had this one, 
when I went to the Ray's website, I saw that they also have a hickory brown, a hickory smoke one. Um, but I just picked up the regular one because that's what they offered at Target. It's a pretty decent sized bottle. It's the 18.5 ounces. And I'm so happy about this because I love barbecue sauce and I limit myself so much. This has four total carbs, one fiber, and one added, one total sugar with uh, zero added sugars. So I guess natural sugar comes from the tomato product, but that makes it three net carbs for two tablespoons. There's only 15 calories for two tablespoons. I am like so excited. I had grilled up some turkey burgers over the weekend and I had made extra so I can have like my 11sies. Um, and I had one yesterday and I, with uh, some leftover bacon and it was really good. And I wanted barbecue sauce on it really bad. My favorite burger, if I ever go to like a Builder Burger place, and not that you anybody's asking, <laughs> like I used to get it from um, from the Outback when the Outback was. I lived right really close to the Outback in New York, um, actually, and the group home was really close to an Outback too, so it was kind of catch twenty two. But when I did Builder Burger, it would be um, burger, bacon, grilled onions mushrooms like sauteed mushrooms cheddar cheese and barbecue sauce that's my ultimate burger if you haven't try it i recommend if you like all those things try them together this stuff is really cool though it's like perforated paper this is so much better than bubble wrap i'm like so excited i might have to order from target all the time i had a five dollar gift card from the last time we were at target sometimes target does one of those if like if you buy these paper towels with this toilet paper, you get a $5 gift card or whatever, or spend X amount of money on products, you get a $5 Target gift card. And it was just sitting in my account. And when I was talking to my sister about finding this artificial sweetener, I was like, that is so cool. I almost want to craft with it, but don't, just recycle it. Um, I was like, oh, you know what? Target has like stuff you can get on, I didn't know. So what I wanted to buy and try is a no sugar added or salt added. So it's got no sugar or salt added, a natural almond butter. This is California almonds. It, this is in creamy. This is by Mara, Maranatha, 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 Maranatha it looks like, right? Um, and I really did want to try this and I think I'm going to. I brought over a plastic spoon because, gotta try peanut butter. That's what I'm saying. Um, it's not peanut butter, it's almond butter. But, oh. okay, so it's not separated, which is great. It's got some on the lid, which is fantastic. <laughs> oh. Now, it doesn't have any salt added, so I'm not going to be expecting it to taste just like a nut, like a nut butter you'd buy in a jar. It doesn't look like I have to stir it, which is great. Um, oh, it's so smooth. Oh my God, that's so good. Mm. That is so good. Mm. Sorry. Those peanut butter three ingredient cookies would be so delicious with this. Oh my gosh. My mind is reeling. Um, so that's really good. <laughs> I highly recommend that. You know, these types of nut butters aren't cheap because it does take a lot of nuts to make them. Um, the same with like nut milks and stuff. Um, I want to see, does this say refrigerate after opening? So it says no stir. Um, California almonds, sustainably re uh, sourced palm oil made with recyclable glass. It all starts with California, the California sun. Our master roasters and ro uh, then ro wait, our master roaster then roasts and double grinds our almonds in small batches. Our signature process delivers a distinct flavor, a variety smooth texture, uh, and an unforgettable taste. Well, I will agree there. Um, refrigerate after opening, yeah. Because nuts can go rancid, especially without salt. So I was pretty sure that this was going to be a refrigerate after open item. But I'm so excited. That's delicious. Oh, and I have to, I have a whole year to use it. So I'm going to eat fast. Um, 
So that's what I got from the grocery, uh, Target grocery haul. I know it was just four things, but I wanted to just talk to you guys because I know not only do some people do keto, I know a lot of us have type 2 diabetes in this little community that we have here, or some actually have type 1. Um, just to see that there are options out there from quarantine, from COVID, you could stay home and order things that they don't carry this at my Walmart. So this isn't something I can even get in grocery pickup. Um, and when I, because I got my, actually, yeah, I would have had to buy something else because the prices, but um, because I was getting my Metamucil and it was gonna be free shipping, I just went ahead and I said, let me see what else I can get to jump on the bandwagon pretty much. While I was on the website, I ordered some things for my party. I'm not gonna share them now because I wanna surprise my party guests, but stay tuned for the middle of July <laughs> to see that video, okay? Um, I just wanted to tell you that ahead of time because when you see me in the middle of July looking just like this with this exact scenery and you'll know why. So I'm going to say goodbye for now. And as always, you guys take care. God bless. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. So I did a thing. I don't know if you're seeing this with my Casely haul or by itself. But I have been really, really curious about the stuff that they advertise on Instagram. It's like, let me shop so you guys don't have to. But one of the things that was offered on my Instagram feed, and maybe because I follow a couple of keto people, let me just get rid of this and the package. Okay, get rid of the box and sanitize. Sanitize a break. So one of the things that I was curious about, <laughs> um, I got an advertisement for sugar-free candy. Not just sugar-free candy, but sugar-free gummy candy. And sugar free gummy candy sort of gummy candy sort of like my and when I saw these I was like I have to try them. So what I picked up was one, two, three, four. Six, six of the gummy fish. So they're supposed to be like Swedish fish. They say Swedish style fish um, and they're sugar free. But of course, sugar free candy, especially gummies, um, in my opinion, um, usually they have sugar alcohol. So let me look and see what alcohol, I mean, what sugar substitute they're made with. These have a lot of carbs in them. Why do they have so much carbs in them? So these are not keto friendly. These are just sugar free. Okay. But I was wondering, they're good till February, 2022. Okay, that's a long time. Um, they're not keto friendly. They have a lot of carbs. There's four servings per container, four pieces per serving, 115 calories. They're fat free. They're made with sugar alcohol and they're made with molotol. So molotol can be, uh, can have a laxative effect. So it actually says that. Excessive consumption may have a laxative effect. But I will tell you the truth. I'm out of a certain, I'm of a certain age. I'm of a certain age. That when my digestive system doesn't work as sufficiently as it used to be or efficiently. Sufficiently is the right word. Um, and then sometimes I have to have assistance. And what I do now is I just munch on a couple of these. They really help. Um, they do, can give me gas and some brands do give me like, the gas is a little painful. So it's a matter of like loving, like learning, you know, eating and then learning and saying, okay, so if I wanna have, for example, I'll give you the perfect example. If I wanna have CVS, this brand gummy, uh, gel, you know, sugar-free gummy bears, 
I can have like 13 gummy bears. And if I have 14 gummy bears, I'll have painful gas, but 13 gummy bears will help me go. And that's just enough. 14 is too many and I'll have painful gas. So um, I'm gonna test these out as well. And the other thing that I picked up and I have six bags of them are these sugar-free pigs, fruit flavor marshmallow candies. I don't know. So these are, actually these are kind of keto friendly. 15 for 15 pieces. They are only one gram of carbs for 15 pieces. That's a lot of pieces. And again, they're made with Molotol. Um, these are good till December 11th, 2021. By the way, these are from the candypeople.com. I didn't even mention that. They do sell not sugar-free candy. They do sell other candies as well. This is the Swedish pig. Right, it's got a little story. While a pig, while a pig may go oink oink in English, did you know it goes nof nof in Swedish? Pigs have been part of Swedish culture for more than 8,000 years. In fact, early Scandinavian tribes practicing the old Norse religion portrayed the pig as a sacred animal with huh with bristles made of gold I did not know that I will ask Jimmy if he knew that um, sweetened with molotol syrup fat free gluten free so these ones are gluten free actually I didn't look at the story behind the sweet fish oh that's more pigs oh, that's more fish okay The herring, known as scrooming, scrooming, stroming, stroming, in Swedish, has been a key part of Sweden's culture for centuries. Long ago, workers in Sweden were even paid in herring. S Swedes are pros at cooking, pickling, and smoking these small but flavorsome fish whether it's Christmas, Easter, or Midsummer. No festive holiday smorgasbord is complete without pickled herring. And these are sweetened with Molotol syrup, fat-free, gelatin-free, and gluten-free. So these, I guess, are also vegan, if, they're not, if there's no gelatin. Molotol, cornstarch, lactic acid, or maybe not if lactic acid. I don't know if that makes them vegan, but anyway, they're gelatin free. I don't know, it makes them, it's very interesting. That's very interesting. So that is everything from the candy people order. I will definitely taste test them now. Who am I kidding? Hi. candy. Mm, it's so good. Mm -mm, that's dangerous. I never look to see that it says berry flavored. That's exactly it. When I first started chewing it, it was like a strawberry, raspberry, a little blueberry kicked in, or other kind of berry. Those are really good. I can have four. I can have four. These are pretty big. Oh no, I wonder, that looks like a lighter shade of pink. Oh. Those are a different shade and they're a different flavor. I 
it doesn't say. Oh my god, those are delicious. How many can I have? Four pieces. All right, let's try a pig. Because, <laughs> girl. So, I'm pretty sure that these were in six packs. And again, this is not, not again, but this is not sponsored. Oh my god, look how cute. I'm gonna have another one because I'm gonna drink water. The the berry flavored in the Swedish fish was so strong. That just tasted like pure sugar, but not sugar because it's sugar free, so you know what I mean. They definitely have a different texture. There are like you can feel like they're chewing a marshmallow candy. Not like circus peanuts that melt in your mouth, but more like if a gummy bear and a circus peanut had a baby. Those are very interesting. I'm not getting a really strong fruit flavor. to be fruit punchy but not very strong i like it it's good when you don't want something that's too sweet but then you just want to chew it almost feels like it's going to be gone and it'll never go away but eventually it does those are really good and i don't know if this is like pigs as a traditional candy that you can find all over sweden i'm not sure but they're really good i will let you know oh my gosh these are really good well, I guess if you ate seven, it would be zero carbs. But. <laughs> those are really good. I just bought different candies to have for my party. Um, like I said, these ones. I thought both of them were keto friendly, but only this one is keto friendly. Um, the fish aren't. So, well, they're really good. Wow, candy people. Hey, you want to sponsor a girl? No, I'm just kidding. Those are good. This I wanted to try for the first time. Like I said, this is not sponsored. I was just kidding. They're really good. I'm going to try other ones the next time I make a big purchase. But for right now, I'm loving this. Um, if you guys have any questions at all, leave them in the description box down below. No, don't do that because I can only handle the description box. You do the comments. Let me start over. If you guys have any questions for the candy people, if you guys have any questions leave them in the comments down below i will link in the description box these two purchases the, the the links to their purchases in case you're interested in trying either one of them and if you haven't yet click subscribe when you do a little bell will pop up when you ring that bell youtube will let you know whenever i upload a new video and don't forget to share with friends and family whether you're doing keto or you just need sugar-free candy um definitely let your family and friends know who are maybe interested in purchasing this particular brand of candy from the candy people I can't believe this is sugar free. This is so sweet. Loving it. Those are really good. Sorry. You know, I want to pause for a second. I am a sweets person. I do like some salty things on occasion, but if you gave me like free reign to eat all the potato chips in the world or one bag of Swedish fish, I would pick the bag of Swedish fish in a heartbeat. In fact, I would probably pick two Swedish fish over all the potato chips in the whole world. That being said, these are amazing. I do like some salty things about once a month, if you know what I mean. Um, 
but the words I I, I don't even know the words so <laughs> these are so good I don't want to go back and eat more but I know I can't so okay so let me start over you guys have any questions leave me in the comments down below And as always, you guys take care. God bless. We'll see you next time. Bye.